Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we are back, and yeah, this is something that has happened right now. We're saying goodbye to Flash. Now, Flash, of course, if you don't know this, is the program that lets us play games, watch videos, and run applications on the web. But after at the end of 2020, Flash is going to be gone. This is actually very sad because um, Flash is the most important thing to play games and to do stuff like that. So, this is actually kind of upsetting. I'm not going to lie. Now, Flash was actually the best thing that ever happened. Um, one, because, dude, you can actually play games at school, bro. That's, like, epic, bro. So, yeah, that's actually pretty sad. So, what are, uh, my question is, what are they going to do? Like, what are we going to use now for, like, to play games and stuff, you know? Okay, let's read. Today, Adobe announced its plans to stop supporting Flash at the end of 2020. For 20 years, Flash has helped shape the way that you play games, watch videos, and run applications on the web. But over the last few years, Flash has become less common. Three years ago, 80% of desktop Chrome users visited the site, visited a site with Flash each day. Today, usage is only 17% and continues to decline. This trend reveals that sites are migrating to open web technologies, which are faster and more power efficient than Flash. They are also more secure so that you can be safer while shopping, banking, or reading sensitive, sensitive documents. They also work on both mobile and desktop. desktop. So you can visit your favorite site anywhere. These web technologies became default experience for Chrome late last year. When sites started to needing to ask your permission to run Flash, Chrome will continue phasing out Flash over the next few years. First, by asking asking your permission to run flash in more in more situations and eventually disabling it by default we will remove flash completely from chrome towards the end of 2020 if you like regularly visit a site that use flash today you may be wondering how this affects you Yes, yes, I know, yeah. If the site migrates to open web standards, you you shouldn't notice much of a difference. It says that you will no longer see prompts to run Flash on that site. If the site continues to use Flash and you give the site permission to run Flash, it will work through the end of 2020. It's taking a lot of close work with Adobe, other web browsers, other browsers and major pub publishers to make sure that the web is ready for flash free to ready to be flash free we're supportive of adobe's announcements today and we look forward to working with everyone to make the web even better okay wow I didn't know that they were here for like 20 years. Uh, that's actually insane, dude. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. This is kind of sad. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Goodbye to Flash. Goodbye!